Hey, what's up? Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video um, on this new streaming software that I found. Uh, big shout out to AJ, the CEO, for uh, making a video on it. Um, just wanted to share it with you guys, too. Uh, it's called Prism, and it basically looks like they revamped o uh, OBS, uh, which I think is open source anyway, so they uh, kind of took it and <sighs> really beautified it, I think, too, and added a lot of extra bells and whistles. So here it is. I've already set up a bunch of things in it. As you can see, if we put OBS side by side with it, um, it pretty much looks the same. As you can see here, um, we've got a hamburger menu here with a lot of the settings here, which see you know, OBS. You got the settings option right there. Uh, there's a channel section here, which is where you'd put in your uh, social media. So I've already got my uh, gaming channel set up uh, for YouTube. And uh, again, down here, we've got our scenes. Uh, you can do the studio mode. Same thing here. Uh, where are you going to see some of the differences? Obviously, the layout is, looks a little prettier. But uh, if you go into, like, say, source, we'll just add a source in here. Uh, and I'll do text template. And you can do lower thirds in here. A lot of this stuff you had to get pl plugins for. So in here, you don't seem to have to do that. So I've got my camera set uh, 4K right now. So I've got a title here that I can go ahead and change. Uh, if I want to put my opening uh, stream, I can put that in here too. So let's say if I want to make this my start stream screen. And while I have that up, I can do uh, Prism Chat. So I can have my chat window in the corner here as well. Let's pop that on to the side here. And we'll just make this a little bigger. And then maybe down below, we can also add, what else? Uh, we could do a, a viewer count also. Let's see how many people are there. Let's hit OK on that. And maybe pop that down in here in the corner. I might want to make this a little bigger. Oops. I can scale this up. Yeah, it's definitely a lot of uh, things that you have to get plugins for. You'll see right away in here. And we'll add one more thing here. Uh, let's see. Oh, we got an audio visualizer too, which uh, a lot of these things have. Like I said before, you had to get a uh, plugin to do. Let's see if it'll pick up my voice here. It should. Uh, desktop audio. I haven't gone into the, the audio settings yet, so let's see. Although you can see my audio moving here. Uh -oh, oh, let's see. Let's go back in. I think I saw something here. Uh, detail settings. That's through that. Uh, should be Mike. There we go. So, so we've got different ones here. That looks kind of cool. So I got a cold, excuse me. <laughs> so, uh, let's see, we'll take this up a notch here. So we can add that in. A lot of cool little uh, bells and whistles. Uh, I think you guys will like it. Um, add a little pizzazz to your live streams without uh, having to put plugins in, <laughs> which, you know, I'm a, uh, I, we all use OBS, <laughs> all of us, you know, I just uh, hear something a little different, I think that's pretty cool, so down in here you could probably put, I don't know what I would use this bottom ticker for, but still pretty cool, all right, let's just delete that one for now, um, so again, you got your channels here, um, so all this will be populated in here. Uh, we go into, let's see, where is it? Settings. Let's see, there's also uh, filters and a bunch of that stuff too. Um, <coughs> which I won't do any of that right now. Just a, sh a quick, quick video. I wanted to make this to show it to you guys. Uh, I will leave a link you know, for you guys to download it too. Uh, where I'll link where you can download it. Uh, let's see. So I think the settings probably is going to, yeah. So here's my account. We got our output. 
all the same stuff that you see in OPS. Yep. Yes, but let me know what you guys think about it. Um, I hope uh, this helps, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.